Welcome back to channel everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can migrate multiple site pages from a communication site to a team site using Power Automate. This is my communication site with the name of my comm site. And as you can see, I have uh, multiple site pages created here. If I go inside any of the pages, this is uh, how the page look like. I want to migrate all the content inside this page to my team site. And if I go inside the uh, my this LTIT team site there is a uh, inside site pages there is only one template apart from that nothing there so I want to migrate everything from this communication side to this team side so we'll go into power automate and try to create instant cloud flow with the name of uh, migrate site pages trigger will be manual once created, we'll go to the next step. And this one will say get file properties only. This step will get all the files properties, which is inside my this site pages. So we'll select the site address here. My com site and uh, library name it's site pages, which is not coming by default in the enter custom value. Either you can type site pages or you can go to your uh, com side uh, site pages go to the library setting and the top url you will see list equal to id there copy this one paste it here remove this uh, percent 70 which is uh, curly brushes closing a sky code and this percent 7b is opening curly brashes code so remove this this is our uh, site page library id once this is done next step will be control apply to each each value of this list of items which we get from this get file properties because we have n number of files and will iterate through each of them and here we will perform a copy file step SharePoint copy file site address will be my current site where all the pages reside which is my com site and file to copy will be a file identifier which is in our case this get file property only identifier once we have this one will select uh, the destination site address in our case this is LTIT and destination folder where we want to copy the data is our site pages again so in case you are not getting this option of site pages you can type that manually as well right like slash site pages and uh, one more option is there if another file already there you can either copy with a new name fail this action or replace in my case I want to replace this you can select any of this step save your flow once my flow is saved I'll uh, go to run continue run this flow our flow started in background and as you can see the get file property it succeeded and now this is inside apply to each I'll go to my site pages as you can see it is uh, already started creating pages here home page is created with this layout right now it's creating more pages we'll wait uh, until our flow is succeeded now as you can see our flow is throwing us an error it's saying uh, flow run failed but it is actually not failed i'll show you that uh, we'll go to our LTIT site pages and you can see all the pages has been created here successfully and important thing is inside a template folder as well it has created a new template file as well all right so if you go to the flow and you see that uh, next fail option it will say a file not found and if we go here the file to copy is that site pages template so it is not able to create that one and in our case that is not an issue for us because we already had a template folder created already so if you do not have a template folder you will not get this error even if you have then uh, don't mind that it's not an error actually 
right because if you go here in your com site you will see all the pages that we created has been replicated here in our uh, site pages you can open any of the pages all the content inside our site pages that were here is same as it is we have and few things to notice is that uh, in our this com site we have uh, embedded a document library folder which it is not able to copy because this is coming from a document library as you see here the document library thing is not there so these are the cases but apart from that structure wise it will copy the entire structure of your site pages right and in the team side if you do not like this left navigation you can straight away go here and go to your change to look navigation change your navigation as in horizontal and now you will see that your team site look like a com site as well right and has the same structure that we are looking into our communication site so that's the way you can copy your uh, site pages from one collections to another site collection and it could be a team site to team site teams to com or coms to team as well i hope you like this video if you do like don't forget to subscribe learn on tech thank you so much for watching